What's going on, boys? Oh, back at the desk. The U-47 is done. And so is my shop white. Time for a new one. But I digress. So, I just got it done. Got all the guys put in it, just got it strung up. So, without further ado, this is my entry into Fred Henry's Life, of, uh, life After Work tribute build to Master Chief Solomon Bucket. Um, it's an honor to know you, sir. Um, I hope you appreciate this and take it with the sentiment that it was built with. So, there we go. See if I can get it better lighting. I, my lighting's not very good down here now, but there we go. We'll see if I can bring this around here. Oh, I know what. Why don't we do this? There we go. See the guys in there. Put the guys in here. I know I should have put lights in it. Shame on me for not, but there it is. Not bad considering the condition that the railings were all in. Um, thanks to Tom, Rambo 69 there, old, old Tom, told me that this kit, this kit was original in 1975, and it has been reissued eight times, and I got the eighth. I looked on the side of the box, it's 2015. So that's why that explains to me why the railings were all messed up and the and this, this side, this side here was all messed up. So, but uh, yeah, well, considering, considering, um, I was debating on whether to weather it or not, but seeing where it's a display, um, like they have the cutaways, um, all the cutaways I've ever seen of engines or anything like that were were pretty clean, so I based it on that. Um, yeah, I guess I could have done the other side. I guess I could have, but I didn't. <laughs> so, so there it is. Not bad. Uh, yeah, it's, it's going to be almost two feet long. So, but, uh, yeah, the gun goes up and down. This little gun here goes up and down. So, but uh, without light, you, you can't really see inside of it, guys. That was shame on me. I should have put lights inside of it, but. I've never done lighting before, and uh, Benny from Food Bar said he was going to put a little vid together for me to show me what I got to get, but I just never done it, and I would like to do it, so, but there it is, you see the little guys in there, it was fun putting them in. We got the captain up there looking at the looking at the scope, but not bad, not bad. Like I said, considering everything that was wrong with it, uh, terrible fit issues. You know, one of these days I'm gonna get a kit that that's gonna go together with no fee. Yeah, okay, but there it is. I'm happy with it. I hope Solomon's happy with it. Uh, It come out pretty good, like I said. But there it is. So, 
All right, Fred, you can put me down. It's done, buddy. It's all done. All done. So, we'll go around one more time, and then uh, we'll pack it up. I got to find a spot for it. Uh, no, the dive planes do not work. They do not move, unfortunately, but... Um, yeah, but so that's what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. Oh, I think the railings come out pretty good. I had a... Uh, this railing over here I had to practically rebuild. I was missing a few. And you guys know I had to make that and that, that from scratch. But those were okay. Uh, these things back here I had to make. I had to make those. But other than that, she's done, boys. She's done. Salutin, salute to Solomon. No. There it is. Okay, guys. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think, Solomon. So, all right, boys, on to the next. The, I'm on to the Cancer Awareness Build from Mindless Model Works. I'm building the 53 Ford pickup in honor of my mom. So, we'll start that. I already got the motor done on that and stuff. You guys have, you guys have seen the motor. That's all rigged up, ready to go. So, but, there it is, boys. There it is. Leave me a comment. Good or bad, ugly. So, all right, guys. Peace out.